Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Creative Connections. My name is James Bowerman with the Real Creative Group of Douglas Realty, and I'm here today with Vince DeCrecy with Chimney Tech, and we're going to be talking a little bit about fire safety uh, with your chimney and your fireplace. So Vince, thanks for being here. Thank you for having me, James. For those people who are watching that don't know you, tell us a little about who you are and what does Chimney Tech do? Okay. Chimney Tech uh, is a full service chimney sweep and inspection company. We actually just celebrated our 25th anniversary. Uh, we right. do, yeah. Uh, that was a huge uh, accomplishment for us. We uh, specialize in uh, chimney inspections for real estate transactions, but we also do fireplace and chimney restoration. With the changing seasons, you know, we're getting into that time of year. People want to start using their fireplace. Safety concerns, you know, we don't want them to burn the house down, right? You know, so tell us a little bit about what should somebody look for as far as fireplace safety uh, to make sure that that doesn't happen. One of the common questions that we do get is how often should I have my chimney cleaned? Well, it's not necessarily the cleaning part, it's the inspection part. Uh, the national standard is uh, that all chimneys should be inspected annually. Sometimes folks will say, well, I don't have a fireplace. Another thing is if you heat your home by a gas or oil furnace or sure. a gas or oil water heater, that vents into some sort of chimney. The danger with that is not uh, a chimney fire, but carbon monoxide and you can't see it or you can't smell it. Tell us a little bit about the, the inspection. Uh, what, what does that process look like? Right. Our inspection, uh, we uh, do a level two chimney inspection. That's our most comprehensive inspection. We start at the top inspecting uh, the chimney cap, the concrete crown, mm -hmm. the brickwork, uh, the flashing on a chimney where the chimney meets uh, the roof line, a lot of times you can get leaking there. And then, you know, if it's a fireplace, we'll end up on the inside. We have uh, what we call a lighthouse, a video camera. It's like a rotor router for chimney. Okay. And it can see a 360 degree view of the inside of a fireplace or a furnace flue. You, you just can't see up a chimney 15 feet or 10 feet sideways this thing spins and it's it's pretty cool that's cool yeah, yeah. using technology right it's one right up my alley one object of curiosity i have here is you know maybe it's this mary poppins reference of right. this chimney suite up on the top with the broom yeah it's not like that what, anymore what does that process look like as far as getting a chimney clean most of our cleaning occurs from the bottom Okay. Uh, nowadays we use uh, a mechanical cleaning system it's hooked to a drill and it has flexible rods that uh, attach to that drill and we use a vacuum system and it's like I said rotor router okay. goes up the chimney and the drill spins it back and forth and cleans it out once the cleaning process is done that's when we'll do that video scan okay. and finish that inspection you're very involved in the community um, this is a time of year where we're all you know giving thanks and you've been giving back now for a while you've kind of built your business on that so tell, tell me a little bit about what your involvement with the community has been well, that has to do with our, our core values and our why. Yeah. Chimney Tech's why is to help other people, whether it's my customers have safer homes or help my employees or help with nonprofits and ministries in the community. So we partner with four uh, ministries in the community, Burgers and Bands for Suicide Prevention, as we all know. Suicide is at an all-time rate for youngsters and even adults. The last event that Burgers and Bands had raised over $80,000, which stays right yeah. in the school system. The other ministry that we're proud to uh, partner with is Be More Caring. They feed and clothe the homeless in Baltimore. They go out every Tuesday. We also uh, support uh, Drink at the Well, which is a nonprofit in uh, the Brooklyn area that helps women in crisis. Okay. A place to stay, they mentor them, things like that. And we also support Youth for Christ, which is in the, uh, in the public school systems, okay. mentoring young men and young women and, and building character and wow. things like that. Yeah. That's great. That's yeah. a lot. Um, yeah. If anybody would like to assist you in those causes, contributions, anything like that, um, what's the best way for them to get a hold of you or if they're interested in you know, your services to get their right. fireplace inspected, cleaned? Uh, so they can send an email to vince at chimneytech.com. They can call the office 410-796-8450. Uh, uh, All right, well, that's gonna do it. 
Thank you, Vince. Appreciate Thank you for having me, James. I appreciate it. My pleasure. And again, if you have any questions, please leave a comment below and we'll get back to you. Thanks again for watching. Thank you. We'll see you again soon.